good morning to everyone present here. So this is Team Glastic. So we present before you in the Social Venture Youth Exchange our team name Ushak, which presents in front of you the brand called Glastic, our recycled eyewear. We use the plastic, the glass, and the plastic to make it glastic. Turn trash into cash. What we do is, what is the problem? What is the challenge? So when we found out, when we went to the community, we found out trash being loitered. We just then came to know there is a lot of trash being generated. We went to the Menro office, respective Menro office. We went to the central facility and we found out this. This is the trash that comes from different places. So the main problem is that the segregation of the waste is not at the source. If you are able to segregate the waste into different types at the source, we may have a good hand in, in waste management. The second thing is, there is no motivation amongst the people living in the community to actually practice solid waste management. The third problem, ladies and gentlemen, there is no proper collection of waste. According to the report, there are eight barangays in DRT, out of which the top four are Kalawakan, Kamashile, and Pulong Samplok. But when we read the report, we came to know that the dump truck for collection of waste does only go to Kamashile and Pulong Samplok, and that too we only have four staff in 2014. And that's one driver, one collector, and two segregators. But this is the plastic that we generate, and the level of seriousness of problem you can see, we generate this amount of waste, out of which 670 kilogram at about six trucks of waste is recyclable. If it becomes 350 kilogram of plastic, even if we consider 350 kilogram, it's 10,500 kilogram of plastic per month and 1,26,000 kilogram of plastic per year. And to my astonishment, ladies and gentlemen, what I found that the plastic was earlier sent to the cement factory. If it is not sent to the cement factory, our respected sir told us it is being sent to the sanitary landfills. But ultimately, according to the environmental perspective, the sanitary landfill deteriorates the quality of soil. And we don't want to do it for DIT. So, what is our solution? Our solution is establishment of a facility by the plastic company so it will be established in Bulakan, where we will use cheap modern machines and IT infrastructure in close coordination with the municipality. And what's our feature? Our feature is wellness points card system. We want to motivate the community people that yes, you can actually waste, you can actually control the solid waste management. We'll give them cards and dustbins. Whenever our truck goes to their house, they give the card, the person enters, okay, 10 kilogram, and that 10, 10 kilogram amounts to maybe 20 points or 30 points. After one month, two months, or one week, two weeks, if that card has a minimum of 500 points, it equals to 100 peso. So in the form of incentive and a structured analysis, we promote and motivate solid waste management. The second one is the plastic trash that has been loitering around, we have MRF facility, we have shredder, we have everything. But we, by plastic, give it a monetary value. And the third thing is, the community becomes role model, not only in Philippines, but internationally, because plastic recycling is a big problem in every country, especially in India. I come from India, so I know it. If I can implement it here, and I'm sure I can implement it here, it is going to be role model for every country. So how does this work? So you can see this is the plastic facility that we have somewhere in DRT. We distribute dustbins, and when we distribute the dustbins, we give them the point card system, the card, and this is distributed to all these four for an initial launch, and these are the number of households to which we distribute the dustbin. When every time some our truck comes to collect the dust due to the waste, they, they get this, and then the truck goes to the plastic facility, we shred, process, quality check, pack, we brand, market, and sell the trash of DRT Bulacan, recycle into local and international market. I don't propose in front of your business model, ladies and gentlemen, but I invite you to come hand in hand and have a revolution of recycling plastic and waste 
to become a role model and turn trash into cash. Thank you.